We met one day, uh, one night in PB at the PB Short Club. I went there that night because I was going there uh, to surprise a friend of mine named Johnny. Um, within about 10 minutes, I saw her and we started talking and chatting her up and used my charm and it went from there. And uh, that night, I ended up telling her I was going to marry her. She laughed. She didn't take it seriously, that's for sure. Uh, yeah. I didn't know. I, I mean, who? We were just, uh, I guess, going back and forth, messing with each other. She's a beautiful girl. Um, but then, you know, just getting to know her, she was really cool. We got a lot uh, in common as far as music goes and um, just the things we enjoy to do. Um, so, at first, yeah, the physical attraction, but then it became more, of course. Um, I love the way that she cares for our dog. Uh, just that alone is one of the biggest things that since we've gotten her, seeing that, um, I know what kind of a mother she'll be, which is awesome. Um, but I mean, her day-to-day -day thing, she's very caring, supportive of me, um, and loving. She's a loving person. So, I mean, there's not much I don't like about her, that's for sure. <laughs> she won't say the same. <laughs> Went out with a couple of friends. We were at a bar in Pacific Beach. Um, I met Nick downstairs. Uh, he offered to buy me a drink and we continued to hang out the rest of the night. He asked me if I wanted to go dancing um, and we kind of hit it off from there. We went dancing, had drinks, had a good time. And then he called me the next couple days and asked me to go to like a concert. <laughs> and. So we ended up going to the concert. I can't even remember which one it was. And ever since then, we've just pretty much been dating. Well, for what? I just thought he was hot. So I was like, that worked. And then he was like really nice. And he was like fun loving and just like wanted to have a good time. But I could tell he had like a caring side to him. So that's what was I was the most attracted to. After years of dating, we both kind of wanted the same things. We wanted to get married and have kids and have a family and him and I kind of agreed on a lot of the same like moral compasses and we just get along together and like to do the same kind of things. Um, so when the time came, we just decided we would get married. On the day to day, he's just like very caring. He looks out for people. He likes to take care of me, takes care of our dog Dolly. Uh, when he comes home from work and sees her on the bed, he just comes and like cuddles with her for a couple minutes and I just think it's the cutest thing to see them together. They're like little best friends. So I had a feeling when he was going to propose that he was going to do some, he was going to plan some sort of big adventure and he doesn't plan anything so I figured that was going to be the time he was going to give it away. Um, and he did plan a big trip to Temecula a few days before my birthday and he planned everything, the hotel and um, so I was like okay it's totally happening. And then on a Tuesday um, I was out running errands getting ready for the weekend and he asked me to pick up a sandwich and I came home and he had the whole house full of flowers and candles and cute little wedding, you know, knickknacks and stuff. And then uh, he turned, he said, turn around, and he was on one knee and proposed to me. So it was his way of, you know, rowing me off. It was very romantic. It was nice, it was perfect for him and I. It was romantic, just the two of us. Then he took us out to our favorite restaurant and we had a great night.